Welcome on guys, so in today's video I'm going to be talking about how I feel about the new Cold War like beta, I know I'm very very late but it's better more late than late than sorry I guess that's, I guess you would say that anyway so my opinion on it is obviously they said that it's on a um, on a thingy that's not been like fake star like been smoothened or whatever it's on like a newer engine that's not been done correctly because they had to rush it because of I think they like cut off sledgehammer so a sledgehammer is not a thing anymore but like I don't I feel like they, I wish they wouldn't have done that because Cold War to me just feels dead bulky and, and not good at all because I don't know I think the only reason I'll probably ever get Cold War is because of the zombies it's because I'm ran I'm randomly getting into zombies now. Like I played, I've been playing uh, Black Ops Four zombies, uh, at the IX map, dubbed the map in a prison. Those maps have been like really interesting and really good and intriguing to play. I don't, I've only started to get into zombies because Mr. Waffles is back, and he's like my he was like my favorite YouTuber because he always makes the videos like super happy, and smiley and upbeat and gives you energy. While watching his like Noah J, yeah, his videos are good and well edited, well produced, but it's just like he's not like upbeat. He's only upbeat in his streams where he plays like the crab rave and all that. But his videos are dead like, to me, they don't feel as good as Milo's because Milo's is like full of energy. Anyway, my opinion is the game, the multiplayer is absolutely garbage. Obviously, skill based matchmaking makes it even more garbage basically like a rusty rusty trash can type of garbage if skill based matchmaking wasn't in it then i would probably play it but because it was because it was rushed on an engine that it shouldn't have been rushed on plus skill based matchmaking i'm definitely not going to be playing it i'm probably going to be i'm probably only going to play the campaign and zombies and that's it the multiplayer is gone. They should they should just release the zombies the zombies and campaign separately because the, the multiplayer for Call of Duty now is horrendous. The the engine for Modern Warfare for the engine for Modern Warfare I think it was like 2019? 2020? Modern Warfare 2020. That engine was super smooth, super planned out. But the only thing that ruined Modern Warfare for me was basically the skill best matchmaking because I'm I'm good at the game, that well naturally good at the game, not to be big headed or whatever. I'm not like a pro type of level good at the game. I'm just good at the game because I'm just naturally good at the game because that's what I do. I play games and I'm good at the games. It the only games I'm not good at is probably racing games and third person type of games. I don't like those types of games anyway, so of course I'm not gonna be a good at a game that I don't like playing. There's some third person like GTA five. Obviously, that's a third person. I'd play that really good, but obviously the aim is kind of annoying on controllers because, because when you aim down, it like auto locks onto the person's head, so it's easy anyway. So even if I was bad at it, it's just it's just basically hand feeding me like how to kill enemies on GTA. But like on Call of Duty, skill but smash making literally ruins everything because I, I, obviously, like I said, I'm good. But because I'm good, I get put up against people that are my level, plus even better. Because the skill, I would get it if skill based matchmaking was my level versus my level, but it's not. It's literally my level versus my level that's been been upgraded, and I don't want that. I, I like I like it. I like close matches. Like if say I'm playing, I think it's hard point where you get to two hundred or it's capture something. Anyway, say it's like, oh, we're, we're at like 180, and the team's at 190, and then we pull it back, and then we go to 200, and then we win the game. Like, that type of competition is what I like. I don't like competition where you just get destroyed, destroyed, destroyed constantly, just because the other team are all pros, and your team is you, mixed with a noob, pro, like... Your level, noob, your level, and even though, and then the other team is just full of pros, and it's just irritating because you can't, you you can't do anything about it. You can't turn it off. You can't. I mean, unless you're a YouTuber where you get these magic lobbies, where you where you just get noobs walking around looking up at the sky and shit. Then, if you get those lobbies, and obviously, then I was seeing why you're like the best game ever. 
but the only reason Modern Warfare was bad because of the um, skill based matchmaking. And with Cold War having a terrible engine plus skill based skill based matchmaking, that is just the multiplayer is dead to me. The only literally the, the only modes I'll be playing is campaign and zombies, like I said. So if you do want the campaign and zombies like videos, I want a thousand percent would upload them on here. But you need to comment down below and subscribe and all that just to just to, just so I can know you want those types of videos and obviously I might be doing outside videos soon. It's depending. I might do it I might do them after Christmas, like just walking around and exploring and stuff. But I really do hope these this YouTube channel grows because also in two months, I think February, February in in the month in February the month. I'm going to be 1000% getting a PC so I can play games, play games more and all that and edit videos instead of like being this terrible quality. It will obviously be more of an upgrade because I can probably buy a camera with the money that I'm getting for my 18th birthday. But yeah, hopefully I do get a bunch of subscribers and new people joining my videos. Hopefully YouTube actually puts my videos out there instead of just putting them to the side. Because of obviously they don't like new channels growing, obviously, I guess. Even though, I don't know. And anyway, I'm going to stop talking. Please like and subscribe and see you in the next episode of whatever I do. If I have an idea now or whatever.